Okay, so um, please feel free to subscribe to the channel. But today I just wanted to show you um, the dark mode notebooks. It's a 10 pack. I sell it on my Etsy shop, Wholehearted Me. And there's 10 different note paper styles. So let's go through what they are. Um, there's 25 sections in each and you can add your pages as you want. So if we click on the first one, which is lined, we are in here. This is obviously the page where you can write your own title, the spine of the book, it's all here. And then you flick over to the index and then you encounter the hyperlinks. Now, hyperlinks are accessed in reading mode over here. That is writing mode is when the menu comes up and you can see the pen. Reading mode is when there's a circle around the pen and the menu disappears. So reading mode is when you can access the hyperlinks. So let's go to number 11 and you can see the 11's colored in. Let's go to section 17 and you can see that section is colored in. And then when we wanna get back to the main index and work out what's there, then we press the house. If you're on, if you go to section four, home will always be your index. And in here you would write, if this was a work a notebook for home, you might have menus at number four, you might have shopping lists at number six. I'm actually just going to do them separately. You might have a gift list at number eight. You might have birthdays. I'm using the super thick pen so that you can see well. Birthdays lists, that's the medium pen, that looks pretty good. At number 10, so that when you go back into reading mode or hyperlink mode, you can click on number 10, this is your birthdays, go back into writing and then you can put it in here, this is my birthdays list. Now, in here, this is a notebook. This is just a notebook. And you're, on sec you're in section 10. But what you can do in all of these notebooks that I will show you shortly is you can you add then the pages that you want. You can add a page before, after, you can duplicate, you can move the page, you can add it to an outline if you set up a system of outlines, export it, open in a new window, move to trash. But we're interested in the add page after. And we're gonna use the current template because it's in dark mode and the options there are all white. But you'll notice it has the same number. So that's this is our section page. If we tap on it, it'll take us to it. But when we when we um, swipe, you can see that it's we're still in section ten. But now we have a new page, a blank page, and we can go. We can say, okay, family birthdays, and then we can start listing the birthdays and the date so that we've got a record. And then we might want to do friends. So then we, what we're gonna do is, you can see we're on this page that's blue. We're gonna add one more page and we're gonna select the same template and we're gonna tap on it and it's blank. So you can see there's the section um, heading, birthday list. And we can say here, we're gonna do birth, we're gonna do, um, family, we're gonna do friends, you might have workmates. Um, so you've got your family and then you've got your friends and then you can jot that down and you can put the date next to it. Don't you love the square function? Press and hold, perfect square. Well, I didn't quite do that right. So if we go back to the big picture, you can see here, I won't tap it because it'll put me into the document. That's the birthdays um, section page. And then we can add pages as we want. That way you can, instead of having a 700 page document, you actually can add the pages you want under the sections that you want. That's why it's being created that way. So now let me show you, if I go back, I will show you what all the notebooks are. So this, is lined, as you can see. This one is narrow lined. So, sorry, you can see how narrow those lines are. They're a lot tighter together and some people prefer that. 
Um, this one is dotted, so you can see the dots. Can you see those dots? There they are. And look, it's always personal preference. There's a line here so that you can make notes over on the side. Uh, notebook four is Cornell. I love Cornell. So here's the here's your title. You can write here. Your index always looks the same. And then Cornell is when you can start making notes. Um, subheadings go here. Press and hold. Don't you love? Let's do it so you can see it. A square in good notes. I love it. And then you can write your text here. And then you might have a summary down here. And of course, you don't have to draw clouds, but I love clouds. So that's the Cornell. We have a few versions of Cornell because we love Cornell so much. This is the Cornell bullet. And as you can see, there's just dots. So if you were drawing, you would have dots to work with. And then if you were drawing a triangle, <laughs> and then if you had to draw another rectangle, and if you want a little square, and then if you wanted some square windows. Oh, funny shape windows. Let's do this one funny as well. Yay! Then you could draw a tree, and we're getting a bit carried away. You get the idea. That's the Cornell bullet. The Cornell blank. That's a beautiful thing. Look at that. Look at that. It's to your heart's content. I love blank. <laughs> Yay! And don't forget, in good notes, you can always grab all your stickers. Summer is my season. How's that? Love summer. That's the Cornell blank. Going back to now your straight bullet notes. And you can see there they are. They can guide your hand. You can write, draw, do whatever you need there. Then a grid for those that love a grid. Oops, it's a grid. Yep, your very basic grid. Um, now we have two columns. So for the, all, the, all your list needs, you can do your thing, separate out your work, brainstorm, and then we have three columns when you need to do that thing as well. And you need to get something happening here, something happening here, and something happening here. Will that work? Sort of, but not quite. <laughs> so yes, they are all the notebooks that come in the 10 pack. Um, such a bargain. This is your forever notebook. We have all the light mode as well, but this is the dark mode notebooks. So please feel free to like and subscribe at that really helps with my channel and i will see you in the next video